Major General Bruno Hochmuth was a public figure in San Diego in the 1960s, but to Lynn and Jimmy, he was just a great dad. In January, the Mount Soledad National Veterans Memorial honored Major General Bruno Hochmuth. My dad was an absolutely great dad. The general's daughter, Lynn Kinjimi, spoke that day about her father's heroism. He was such a special person. He was a special Marine. General Hochmuth died in Vietnam on November 14th, 1967, when his helicopter exploded. When your dad died, it was front page news. It was. This is the San Diego Evening Tribune. Five service members died in the crash. We got hundreds of letters from people all over the world. This one from Ronald Reagan. When I read them, I feel my father's presence. My dad did what good Marines do. He went to duty. It was his life work. Lynn was 17 years old when her father died and told me her greatest fear at the time. I kept thinking, I hope I can remember him. I hope I can remember him. We may have something that will help you remember him. Will any phase of the training have to be eliminated or curtailed? No, we are. This is CBS 8 anchor Harold King. Oh, yes. Interviewing okay. your father. Okay. We're going to a full 24 hours a day. Is it Mario nice to hear his voice? Hearing his voice is really amazing. General Hopemuth served as commanding general at the Marine Corps Recruit Depot in San Diego, and CBS 8 archives are filled with footage of his service. Do you remember this? Yes, I do. That's me. There, he's leaving. It's the last day I saw him. And this is at the airport? This is at the airport. And I had just turned 17. That's the last I saw him climbing on that plane. CBS 8 covered the general's funeral. You've never seen this footage? I've never seen this footage. Up to the cemetery, uh, Fort Rosecrans. For many years, I couldn't go to his gravesite. It was just too hard. General Hochmuth was awarded the Distinguished Service Medal and buried with full military honors. So that's me. The military does a beautiful job of honoring their fallen. Lynn says she'll cherish these memories with her sister, children, and grandchildren. I used to feel really angry that I only got my dad for 17 years, but then I realized that I was lucky to have him for 17 years. He was a great dad, and not a lot of people that I know have a dad that I would trade for. <laughs> in the Zevely Zone. That's beautiful, thank you. <laughs> Jeff Zevely, wow. CBS 8.